somebody can put it up there. Yeah. 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 Great. Well, good morning, everybody, and welcome. Uh, my name is Tom Miles. I'm the dean of the University of Chicago Law School, and it is a great uh, pleasure and honor to be with you this morning and to launch uh, this 2024 conference on competition uh, and antitrust. Um, this conference is really exciting. I'm so impressed by the program. It's, to me, very much in keeping with the spirit of the University of Chicago as a university and as a whole. Um, at the University of Chicago, we were founded with a very specific commitment to scholarship and research, to a belief that ideas matter, that questioning is a high calling, and that we should be enthusiastic about the life of the mind. And we believe that because we believe that ideas can transform the world. And I think for our faculty over the history of our university, this has meant a desire to study the most important phenomena in our world, to think deeply and ambitiously, to analyze rigorously, uh, and to question. Uh, question conventional wisdom, to be unafraid uh, to do that. We've often done that in an interdisciplinary way, by borrowing tools and methods from other disciplines to develop new insights and develop new understanding. And I think this conference is such a wonderful illustration of that. For those of us like me from the law school and so many colleagues here from Chicago Booth, as professional schools within a research university, we're especially engaged with the world and engaged with developments and wanting to learn from leading practitioners and regulators and commentators, and also wanting to share our ideas with them and have a great, a great dialogue. And of course, antitrust itself is an incredibly important topic. I mean, fundamentally, it's about the organization of markets and the degree of competition within them. And yet we see through this conference and through the series of conferences that the Stigler Center has hosted on antitrust since 2017, the implications extend far beyond that. And you can see in the program, this conference is going to question how antitrust and competition policy affect the willingness of firms to innovate and to invest, and ultimately how this could affect the standard of living and economic growth, how it affects the development and emergence of new technologies, and ultimately affects potentially inequality within our society and the operation of democracy. So it's an incredibly important and vibrant uh, topic, uh, and it's really great to see these intellectual developments continue. Of course, the University of Chicago has a great history in antitrust uh, scholarship, and it's always done that in an interdisciplinary way. I don't know if it was the origin point, but certainly I think one of the uh, inflection points or milestones of this was beginning in the 1950s, the law school offered a seminar in antitrust law that was co-taught initially by the economist Aaron Director, and then faculty member, eventually dean, eventually university president, and attorney general of the United States, Edward Levy. And so for many years, they co-taught this seminar with an economist and a lawyer. Uh, and then some years after that, in the early 1960s, George Stigler, namesake of uh, the Stigler Center, co-taught that seminar uh, with Edward Levy. I've had the privilege of meeting some of our graduates who were students in that seminar, and they've told me it was a remarkable intellectual experience that Stigler and Levy alternated weeks in teaching the seminar. In each week, one of them would come in and tell the students that what they had learned in the prior week was completely wrong, and now they were going to fix it. And so that spirit of exchange and dialogue and commitment to uh, disagreement and to probe the insights and reasons and sources of disagreement, I think is very much reflected in the spirit of this conference. So it's wonderful to welcome you. I thank our organizers. I thank all of our panelists for being with us. I especially want to thank Filippo for being our champion and leader for this conference. Uh, again, welcome everybody. I look forward to the program. <laughs> 